Cynodontis petricola and Cynodontis lucifinis, two very similar catfish from Africa, from Lake Tanganyika, and uh, I will talk about their similarities and uh, differences on this video. Uh, by no means I am an expert in this uh, field or or anything like that, but uh, it's what I found on the internet and uh, the findings of uh, others. So I just put together this video uh, for uh, clarification. Let's talk about uh, Cynodontis petricola. Cynodontis petricola is the uh, bigger of the two. Uh, their maximum size uh, would be uh, will be about 5.5 uh, inches, uh, whereas uh, Cynodontis lucifinis, their ma maximum size would be about 4.5 inches. The spots of the Cynodontis petricola is more uh, uniform, reformed, uh, more rounded, um, very similar in uh, sizes overall. And the spots on the head of the Cynodontis uh, petricola uh, is much smaller than uh, compared to the, uh, the spots of the uh, Cynodontis lucifinis, the spots on the head. Compare the spots of this uh, Cynodontis lucipenes uh, with the spots of a uh, Cynodontis petricola. Notice the spots of this lucipenes on the body. It, it, the spots are not are not really circular, and uh, it's it's misshapen. And uh, the the spots on the heads are much bigger uh, compared to the uh, Cynodontis petricola. Uh, the petricola also has a much longer body, uh, overall overall length, and uh, also tends to swim more like a, in a more uh, serpentine motion uh, compared to the uh, Cynodontus uh, lucipinis. Here is a picture of a male, an adult male. Uh, notice the long, slim body, the uh, circular. Uh, spots on the body, the small spots on the head. Here is a picture of an adult female. Notice that the uh, spots on the body are uniform and uh, very much circular. And the head, the spots are very small. Younger Cynodontis petricola will have uh, spots that are that are not fully developed yet, so their spots would be irregular until they until they reach uh, full maturity. Cynodontus petricola is the uh, the more rarer of the two, so the chances of you finding a cynodontus uh, a true cynodontus petricola in your local fish store is much will be much more uh, slimmer than uh, uh, finding a Cynodontus lucifinis. One major difference between the Cynodontus petricola and the Cynodontus lucifinis is that the Cynodontus petricola has this thing called the uh, auxiliary pore. Now the auxiliary pore, uh, what that is, is a, uh, a hole uh, located right below the uh, humeral process. Uh, and the humeral process is uh, right behind the gill, right on top of the uh, pectoral fins. Here is a close-up photo of a uh, Cynodontus petricola. Uh, notice the uh, auxiliary pore. Barely.
but what if you have a fish that looks everything like a Cynodontus lucipenes, but uh, you found you took a photo and you found that it has uh, an auxiliary pore. Now, what does that mean? Uh, it could mean that your fish is a hybrid. A hybrid is when two species interbreed and uh, Cynodontus petricola and lucipenes they will interbreed freely so this could happen see if you can tell which ones are Cynodontus petricola and Cynodontus lucipenes in this picture. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, if you did please like share and subscribe and uh, please make sure that you hit the uh, notification bell thanks